Hello, welcome back to Emma's Handy Tips. Today I've got a very good tip to do with clothes and getting oil stains out of them. So being a chef I get oil stains all over my clothes from it splattering when I'm cooking and because I can't get the oil stains out I tend to put my clothes away and not wear them because I you know, don't want to wear dirty clothes. So I've looked around and I've found a really good solution and I'm going to show you how to do it. The first item we have is either RP7 or WD-40. The reason we use that is to wet the oil and loosen it to get it ready for soaking. The next item we need is bicarbonate soda or baking soda. This helps suck up the oil and excess RP7. Next is an old toothbrush to scrub in the bicarbonate soda. And finally, dishwashing liquid. It's just uh, helps as a pre-wash soak before you put it in the wash. So here's my t-shirt. It's a bit hard to see the oil stains on it, but they're definitely there. Um, I put a piece of cardboard in between the front and the back to make sure that the RP7 doesn't go in between because you don't want to be doing both sides for no reason. Okay. Okay, so I've sprayed on the RP7 on the spots that had oil. So now, all you have to do is put some baking soda on the spots. Like so. I'll just rub it in a bit. get a little brush and we just brush it so it's hard to do with the camera so I'm gonna do it properly in a sec but basically we're trying to brush it into the oil and soak it up and we'll be doing this probably two times with a good scrub to get the excess oil and RP7 up and I'll show you what it should look like after it's done Alrighty, so that's two times I've scrubbed it with the bicarb soda and now it's looking not so wet, so it's been dried off. Now I'll just give a shirt a good douse of dishwashing liquid and we just scrub that in as well. And once we've done that, just let it sit for a bit, for, you know, half an hour just to let it soak in and then just do a normal ordinary wash and I'll show you the results once I've done it. All right so there's the shirt it's all dry I thought I'd just film it on the line before it gets dark it looks pretty good it was it's an old shirt and it had a lot of stains so many stains that there's just no way I could wear it all through here and all down here and they're pretty much all gone now so I'll be able to wear the shirt again I'm pretty happy. I've got a lot of jumpers that are just sparkling new that I'll be able to wear again. So if you're really keen on getting your clothes back, I'd I'd give it a go because it, it really does work. So that's uh, that's that. Well, that's the end of my demonstration. Good luck cleaning your clothes and uh, see you next time on Emma's Handy Tips.